All right, this is, um, I think I showed this off in one of my videos. This is a uh, keyboard overlay for a uh, RetroArch that I, I made this in like May 2019, and I haven't really touched it since. Um, but I mean, it still works. For the most part, I think it works. I think there's also some issues with it that I need to fix, but uh, for right now, it works. What do I want to test this with first? <sighs> I think <laughs> Mario Teaches Typing could be a good demo of this. I'm not really going to be using the joysticks. I have the mouse mapped to the touch screen or the joysticks, which is nice. So to get the overlay, you go into, that is the quick menu, you go to on-screen overlay, and I think you have to turn display overlay on, um, and then you can change the opacity of the overlay. I like to use it on a 0 0.7, so you can still see the game through it. Overlay preset, um, wherever you put it on your SD card. It might be in here. Personally, mine is in keyboards, uh, switch keyboard dark. And I think the config in the download is going to be named different from this, but it's the same file. So when you boot up, you basically get nothing except this little show. You can press that and it shows you a whole keyboard. Um, it's I tried to style it like a, uh, a PC keyboard because, you know, I made this for playing DOS games and stuff. Um, you can switch between ABC and numbers, similar to how uh, smartphone keyboards work. So you got F keys, uh, escape, control alt stuff like that i tried to include everything i could that made sense i think i feel like i might have gotten all the keys on here including the arrow keys and this uh, nintendo switch is the um the windows key i think <laughs> i haven't touched this in a while that's backspace um you can hide and show it and it'll stay on whichever letters or numbers that you're switched to. There's backspace on here too. Um, all these symbols are, I think, close to the same setup as on a PC keyboard. Um, it, uh, I, I rearranged them a little bit um, because I, there just wasn't that much room to fit with the UI, but it works so let's go to i kind of want to show off the whole keyboard so all keyboard and then i think that's uh lesson three all right the whoops you have to hold down shift and press a letter at the same time National. It's a little hard to use. In fairness. Um, I saw maybe less than a month ago. That's the wrong key. There you go. Maybe a month ago or so. I don't know. Someone made a space bar come on oh that's it I'm not fast enough
someone made a actual UI for uh, developing these overlays and stuff. Um, but when I made this in May 2019, I was sort of just reading all the documentation there was. Um, I probably should have made it a different way. Come on. Come on. Come on. Why are there two spaces after that? That was confusing me. Yeah, that's the key. Ooh, maybe that doesn't work. I guess I have more work to do, but... Yeah, so that works for the most part. Um, I was using all the stuff there was. I could have made it so that, like, the keys light up when you press them. I think there's a way to do that in the way I did it, which is, like, a, just a static image overlay. But the other way I could have done it is to make all of these keys individual images and then render them all. And that um, would require me rewriting the entire thing. So I don't think I'm going to do that, at least at the time being. Maybe I'll think about it sometime. But I mean, this isn't even really like a... A optimal way of playing these games. It's just good for playing on the go and especially for debugging without having to plug in a USB keyboard. I think it's handy for that. Um, here, I guess I'll... Um... Um, yeah, let's go in here. And it does work in more than just DOSBox. Um, I think, I don't, are my settings right? Maybe try off? There we go. Yeah, so uh, the arrow keys work. And this game is played using Z and X. Um, I, I think I have some other... Uh, layouts that I could probably make available for download, but I don't know if they're all working at the moment, so I won't bother for now, unless someone wants them really bad. You can just play this with a joystick anyway, but... Yeah. Well, <laughs> that's about it. Thanks for watching.